Uh, this is, to be honest with you, Ikhwan, uh, a problem that we find, and it's an issue that we find uh, in many of the communities around the globe, around the dunya, that uh, constantly the people of Sunnah are criticized for being harsh and criticized for being, uh, yani, or having shidda. Uh, yet still, those same individuals who criticize the people of Sunnah for having shidda uh, have lenience and gentleness with the people of innovation, and they themselves only have shidda with the people of sunnah, which is a contradiction in terms considering it is the people of sunnah who are being accused of having that. And that, brothers and sisters, uh, is and reminds us, no doubt, uh, of the statement of that Imam Muhammad ibn Abdullah suwari who mentions in those lines of poetry, قُلْ لِمَنْ عَانَدَ الْحَدِيثَ وَأَضْحَى عَائِبًا أَهْلَهُ وَمَنْ يَدْعِيهِ أبعلم تقول هذا أب لي أم بجهل فالجهل خلق السفيه أي عاب الذين هم حفظ الدين من الترهات ومن التمويه وإلى قولهم وما قد رواه الراجع كل عالم وفقيه say to the one who dispraises the people of hadith and sees his morning and sees his day عائبا أهله ومن يدعيه dispraising and speaking ill of its people and those who claim it is it with knowledge that you say this? Explain to me. And be jahl. Or is it with ignorance? فَالْجَهْلُ خُلُقُ السَّفِيهِ For indeed ignorance is the characteristic and the character of the foolish. أَيُعَابُ الَّذِينَ هُمْ حَافِظُ الدِّينَ مِنَ التُرُّحَاتِ وَمِنَ التَّمْوِيهِ Will you dispraise those who protect the deen from the turruhat, from the, uh, mis- uh, from the distortions and from the uh, uh, يعني, misconceptions that have been ascribed to the deen وَإِلَىٰ قَوْلِهِمْ وَمَا قَدْ رَوَوْهُ رَاجِعٌ كُلُّ عَالِمٍ وَفَقِيهِ And to their statement and everything that they narrate, every single alim and faqih has to return. And thus, brothers and sisters, it is no doubt a, a contradictory manhaj that a person should dispraise Ahlul Hadith for being uh, shadeed and harsh, yet still uh, they have gentleness with the people of hadith and with the people of sunnah uh, and uh, afwan have gentleness with people of bid'ah and only find having uh, themselves having harshness for the people uh, of sunnah we mentioned ikhwan in the session earlier today that allah azza wa jal has commanded us to be and to remain steadfast with the people of sunnah oh ye who believe fear allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and be <coughs> With the sadiqeen, be with the truthful. And that ma'iyya, and that being with them, is that one be one is with them in the best possible manner. That if you're going to treat anyone, ikhwan, well, then it is the people of sunnah that we treat well. And that, no doubt, opposes that which we see the a'imma of Ahlul Sunnah being upon. Them having love for the people of sunnah, and dislike and hatred for the people of bid'ah. Not brothers and sisters is the methodology and the manhaj of Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah. Ahlul Bid'ati wal Dalala, Ikhwan, understand, are opening doors that are beridun lil kufr. There are doors or pathways to kufr. As the Salaf of this Ummah used to say, Al Bid'atu barid al kufr. Bid'ah is the thing that leads to kufr. How then are we going to be kind and gentle and loving? With individuals, ikhwan, who open up a doorway to kufr. The Christ, the, when the Christians worshipped Isa, and when the Yahud raised Uzair, and referred to him as Ibn Allah, how did that occur, ikhwan? It didn't just occur overnight. Rather, it was a gradual process. That process beginning with bid'ah, beginning with, with innovation. And so, ikhwan, the origin and the asl, uh, is that Ahlul Sunnah are dealt with with the best possible manners. And that Ahlul Sunnah, Ikhwan, those characteristics that return back to Ukhuwa and brotherhood uh, and love uh, and ta'awun return back to Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah. And that is, Ikhwan, from their hukuk and from their rights, Ahlul Sunnah have love for Ahlul Sunnah. And as the Salaf used to say, that there is not a mubtadi in the dunya except that he dislikes Ahlul Hadith. So if we see an individual ascribing himself to the people of Hadith and Sunnah, and his hatred is for the people of Hadith and Sunnah, 
and his bad mu'amala is for the people of hadith and sunnah, then no doubt he needs to check himself in relation ikhwan, to uh, the reality of his manhaj and his ascription to the sunnah. For indeed, Ahl sunnah ikhwan, have nothing but love uh, for the people of sunnah, uh, regardless, ayyuhal ikhwah, of where they are and where they exist and where they dwell. Wallahu ta'ala.